Danny, do you like my, you like my American flag? Oh, this is my moment. USA, USA, USA. <laughs> Great, we gotta join a soccer team now. We got, yeah, we, we got the audience for the soccer team. We just gotta learn how to play. Uh, anyway, so you guys are gonna love our next guest. He has been downtown longer than me, longer than most of the people down here. And he has an amazing story. Um, and he received his doctorate in uh, dank memes. Please put your hands together for Arden, come on out. Spirit flag. Is that how you're supposed to enter the rooms? Yeah. Give me a card. Okay, so that's how you're supposed to enter the rooms, huh? Like you, uh, yeah. you cover in yeah. and... But basically I can do whatever I want. I, I just kind of go with a, whatever feels right. So. Yeah, this is an expression of my freedom, my personality. Yes, it is. Yeah, go America. I like it. Okay, so uh, I want to tell you about this cool thing you're working on now, but I want to start with three years ago, you were here before the Downtown Project really started funding all these different startups. Um, and you talked about how awesome the culture was. I just want to go rewind time to where we are now and talk about things that uh, maybe we've learned from the situation and mm. things that are going right that we should be doubling down on, in your opinion. Yeah, so I, I've been in Vegas since second grade. I went to LVA, which was just down the street. It's a, it's a strange high school. But, um, oh, yeah, I, the, uh, that's like a uh, performing arts. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So I play. French, you guys play I'm a French stuff, hornist, huh? actually. I'm, I'm working my way back into it right now. But um, I see a huge career in it. You know. Basically, the, what what really brought me downtown again after being here for high school, was, that I had started my first company, uh, which was we were actually competitors <laughs> at that point. I like you guys were frenemies. Out yeah, frenemies. Yeah, frenemies. Yeah, we both went out of business though. Same there we team, go. Man. Hey. Oh. There you go. <laughs> All right. Sa same learning lessons. Yeah. But um, so uh, when I started that, I first Googled just if there was any tech scene down here, and there wasn't. And probably three months into that, I decided I had to have overlooked it, and the jellies had started. So I, I was down there pretty much since day one. So explain, explain the jellies. Does, it, who, does anyone know what the jelly is? It's probably too old. Couple people? Okay. So so the jellies were, were like this organic entrepreneur um, think tank. It it didn't Do care. dollar beer. Nice. It didn't care what your background was, it didn't care what your age was. Everyone was just really supportive. And I any time in my life that I've been a part of friendships or groups like that that are so giving and accepting, it that's culturally one of the largest impacts that happened to me every time I, I witness those sort of things. So um, I, I have a deep love for what, what that was. Um, it grew very fast, it changed fast, um, but it, it really was something special. Yeah, no, I, I go, so going back in time, it was the, uh, the announcement of this uh, $350 million had just come through. A lot of people were excited, potentially gonna pitch their ideas, and it was, the Tech Jelly was, it was dollar beer night, but then it turned into people like really sharing apps, like downloading each other's stuff, thinking about what companies could be formed from it. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it would always have this sort of special time, because nobody had really failed yet, so there was no reason to be upset, it was just all potential. Yeah, right? well, and, and the community was so small, this all took place at the beat. Like there was, there was no container park at the time. There was no Inspire Theater. This yeah. was a dirty 7-Eleven. Yeah, give it up. Could have been making hot dogs right here. But. So, so what was cool was that <laughs> they could they could have made hot dogs. Yeah, that's real. That's a that's a legit we, possibility. We could pivot right now. Right. <laughs> Wait, back to hot dogs. Hot dogs are cash. Yeah. Oh yeah, bring them into the back door. I love hot dogs. It's Finally, bad. got a business model for I the podcast. Real, I you. really need to start working out more again. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, but honestly, yeah. this hot dog thing, we should talk about this after. Yeah, <laughs> got to get another failure, and you know, yes. I heard five's the the trick. I'm pretty sure I could do a hot dog stand <laughs> at this point, though. <laughs> okay, well, I want to talk about uh, your newest company because you share a lot of the same views I do about where culture fits into things. Um, you should probably share a lot of the same weaknesses too, but let's talk about what um, your view on culture is and how you've incorporated it. So, 
<coughs> our, cool our, tape company. our yeah. company, really our culture, especially when I talk about it, um, our community is online. So our idea originated out of 4chan, which is strange. Yeah. We're probably we're like the second Reddit. company outside of Iconaz Cheeseburger to come yeah. out of 4chan. But um, that's where you go for a hit. lot. That's where you go for Hitman. Most yeah. of yeah. most yeah. of the memes you like, um, anything that is dank or cat or uh, <laughs> disgusting. Yeah, can't believe you got that on the teleprompter. Dank, doctored in dank mm -hmm. memes. Yes, I do. I do have my MD and DM dank memes. Yes. <laughs> I can tell, yeah, you can't just make one of these without a, a dink no. meme doctorate. No. No. No, that would be terrible for society. But, so I originated off these anonymous communities. So the, you, you really have to uh, be transparent and you have to be open for people to trust you because I was accepting people's money and Bitcoin and all that before I knew how to print before any of it. So I was giving updates on these websites just to prove that I was doing it, and people trusted that. Um, and that's kind of where the community was born. We are community focused. All of our designs, the ideas originate from the community. Uh, and, and, and we, we, we're quite, we, we've grown quite past that. Um, do you feel like you're flying with these things with your arms out? Because that I, I get that feeling. It we, feels fun. Like a fan, I would be just right into it, you know? There there's a roof here. Oh yeah, yeah. We'll find the wind. <laughs> Everyone with the flag things, go north. It'll be good. Yeah. <laughs> Cause it seems, I mean, uh, uh, you going to EDC this year? I'm assuming. Yes, every yeah. year. You guys going to EDC? Anybody? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't know, I can't wait. It's gonna be fun. Uh, Taking the new, the new girlfriend, we good. We are going to uh, probably wear a couple of these, I think. Yeah, dude, you should come with us. Do you like take toy cars as a kid? And I, I like I it was like, it was like, well, I had something similar to that, but it was a rug. Yeah. Yes. And yeah, yeah. Did you have one? Yeah, I had that rug. Yes, yes, I had that. Ah, did you bring this? any cars? Could we? No, roll? sometimes I do, but um, <laughs> this you design. You really need some Velcro ones. That would be the best for the outfit. That is a good idea, actually. Yeah. See, I, I don't try and come up with the ideas. I just try and deliver on them. Yeah. Oh, okay. good. Because I just come up with them and don't deliver, so it's great. <laughs> we're, we're, we're like, this, this is going well. <laughs> this is going well. <laughs> this hot dog's going. Um, okay, so let's, let's jump into it. Uh, everybody, these are called spirit flags. Um, they can go on Kickstarter. They can type in spirit flags, and they can donate to your Kickstarter campaign. Yeah, so this is our first Kickstarter. I like, this is stretchy fabric, by the way. I don't know. This yeah, fabric it. is so awesome. Um, it didn't even exist a few years ago. I can't even say what it's called because my competitors are going to rip it off. Oh, yeah, don't even mention that to them. <laughs> yeah. Jerks. Jerks. <laughs> Figure it out yourself. Wait, just stay right into the camera. Just stay right in the camera. <laughs> Figure it out yourself. It might look good in editing. We'll see. We'll yeah. Be, we don't know. Sometimes it, it works like a miracle. We're, we're just trying to make capes great again. So. Are you guys okay? Yeah, this is a good crowd. Yeah, that subtle thing. Um, okay, so, yeah, going on. The, how long is the Kickstarter going? What can we do to help it, you? Just give it's, money. It's how a much month. How these things cost? Um, and th this is, so I really did the Kickstarter to test myself. Um, we, we have a, a way that we go about business that has been successful, but this is really um, me building my team and showing more of what we're about. And I think that wearing a flag is the best representation of what I want out of my customers. Yeah, I got them chanting America. Flags yeah, are, imagine. Flags are epic. And you visited something else. I like, like we were downtown yeah. Yeah. with all of the different designs we liked, and it was just epic. Everyone, just no one. I, you, I argue, you will be the best version of yourself In while flag. you're wearing a flag. In a spirit flag, yeah. yeah. So uh, people can check out the Kickstarter. They can type in spirit flag, and then they can find these. And if they donate enough, they get the special disappearing one. Spooky. Truth be told. Whoa. 
Thank you, guys.